Morning. I'm still in bed. But I'm going to get up and go get coffee. Because my coffee machine's still not working. I'll be back soon. Ish. I just got back from a walk. And I think there is some good news right now. I believe this is for me. It's not just coffee, it is the descaling to fix my machine. Because my order got lost, they also sent me some free coffee. Okay. Okay, so we've got two absolutely non... Well, that guy just cut the corner so much I thought he was going to hit me. Okay, two not ideal situations. The first is that it got really dark. I wanted to take you guys out vlogging around Sydney. However, the weather, it was so windy and it's... <sighs> You wouldn't have been able to hear anything. So that's a sorry situation if ever I've heard one. It then got really, really dark. Like it's daytime right now, but it's really dark. It was quite warm today. It was like 24 degrees, which for the middle of winter, I mean, people think of Australia as like this big tropical island. It's cold here. Sydney is cold. Melbourne is freezing and Sydney is cold. So it's very dark and I apologize for that. Second non-ideal situation is this. I bought this to use my camera here in my car to vlog. However, I didn't actually realize the suction caps wouldn't stick to my dashboard. And so my camera is once again blue tacked to my the screen of my radio. It's not good. It still scares me, but I trust it enough. I am just on my way to the shops. I have approximately zero groceries in my house. You know in the movies how they show like single young women that live alone, just like sit on the couch every night, eat ice cream and watch movies. That's me, that's actually me right now. Except I watch a lot more cricket. I need to definitely get groceries, some normal food. I wish so badly that I lived near my mom so she could cook for me and so I could spend time with her. I do wish that I lived near my mom so she could bring me food over. Look, nothing's as good as your mom's cooking, is it? So, mom, when are you moving back here? I honestly cannot believe how dark it got. Last night, uh, it was meant to be the second T20 India v Sri Lanka. And it was cancelled because of COVID. COVID ruining everything since 2020. You know that meme? There's like a meme or a quote that says something along the lines of one day you and your childhood friends went out for the last time and you didn't know it. I kind of feel like that's the same with COVID. So COVID got us just at the end of our summer in 20... Well, it was the summer of 2019, 2020. And... Was it 2019, 2020? Yeah, because we just had summer 2021. Okay, I'm smart. Uh, and I kind of feel like it's like that. Like one time we all went out for the last time with our friends in what we knew as the normal world and we didn't even know it. And that kind of makes me sad. We're here. I'll see you all after I buy some food and I'll also get chocolate and ice cream. Like what, what else can I do? Oh, hi. I feel like the light's not very good in here. I'm also probably red in the face because it's really hot. We have a new, uh, digest. Apple cider vinegar, acacia, and wheatgrass. It's very thick. I'm extremely excited to try this. I also, of course, purchased... I can't live without samosa. I feel so parched. Honestly. Okay, I will probably see you again when I get home because... It's dark outside, so you won't see me. So, I'll see you there. Hi! <gasps> the music. Don't want to get copyrighted. I'm just going to put away all my groceries and then I feel like pancakes for dinner. I will show you how I make them. 
They're actually vegan pancakes. This is not a cooking channel, but like what else do we have to do in lockdown? Exercise and cook food and watch way too much Netflix. Actually, you know what? I mostly watch Amazon Prime and I still say I'm just gonna watch Netflix because Netflix is easier to say than Amazon Prime. But actually I watch so many shows on Amazon Prime, especially because they had The Family Man, Mirzapur. Wait, how, do we, how are we pronouncing that? It's pronounced different in different dialects, I feel. M Mirzapur, Mirzapur, Mirzapur. You all know what I'm talking about. I don't even know if I have any ingredients for pancakes. I kind of just make it up as I go along. Quinoa flakes. Actually, you need a, a flour, but I just blitz the quinoa flakes and turn them into a flour. Don't look at what's in my cupboards like. Even I don't know what's in there. Then I'm gonna take apple cider vinegar, bicarb soda, baking powder, plant-based milk. You can use dairy milk if you want, whatever. Ooh, a banana. Everything I put in here is an absolute guesstimation. This is like a cup of quinoa flakes. Someone once told me if you can peel a banana in four, like make the peel four, it's good luck. Oh. I only did three. Then just chuck that right on in there. A teaspoon of baking powder, a teaspoon of bicarb soda, teaspoon of apple cider vinegar. It's kind of like a science experiment. Then I put in my soy milk, like a quarter of a cup. And then I just use the same jug, okay? For like a quarter cup of water. My phone is on 6%. <laughs> Mmm, how good are kiwi fruits? I reckon. Oh, music. Here is my pancake mix. Ooh, look, going well. Ciao. Tonight, staying up all night. India is playing Sri Lanka. Anyway, I expect the team list to come out soon and we will see an extremely different 11 to what we have seen. But I mean, India's got white ball depth. So let's wait and see. What am I gonna put on these? Blueberries, yogurt, or maybe some of you call it yogurt. And you cannot have pancakes without maple syrup. Beauty personified right there. Oi. Bon appetit. The most important thing for getting ready for an all-nighter so you don't feel like trash the following day. First, you need plenty of hydration. Eye drops so your eyes don't dry out because like mine dry out so bad. I'll be sitting there like chocolate. I'm trying this one for the first time. Okay, actually I already opened it. Why am I lying to you? The 3 a.m. Samosas and the last thing you need is a buddy to watch it with oh. It is approximately 8 5 p.m. Which means have about Four hours and 25 minutes until cricket is on Until then I think I'm just gonna read my book in Sydney yesterday They announced that they would be opening a singles bubble if you have a boyfriend or girlfriend, an intimate partner, uh, in lockdown you have already been able to have them to your house. I don't have a boyfriend. The singles bubble allows you to have a friend over or a family member. So I'm really excited to have my best friend over again. Locking down alone sometimes is, it's just a bit boring. Singles bubble, I'm so excited for it. It is 9.30 p.m. and I'm watching Scam 1992. Uh, actually, I think I might be interested in watching, is it JL50? It's like after a plane ride, so it must be JL50 or JL50. I, I think I'm actually interested in watching that, so I might watch that once I finish Scam 1992. Uh, and just like resting as much as possible. So will you be coming to watch the match tonight? Let's go. Mm. Low key loving Dev Dup Padakal. Oh, Dev. To be fair, 132, 133, like, India has a lot of bowlers in the team. It is approximately 1.39 a.m. And you know what the funniest thing is about pulling so many all nighters to watch sport or cricket is that 
you get to like you'll get to this time 1 30 in the morning and it's not even late yet i honestly see the commercials for uh scam 1992 so many times also maharani all right second innings is about to get underway so let's see if the lunkins can chase down 133 it is 2 30 a.m and i've got samosas in the oven <laughs> It wouldn't be an all-nighter without eating samosas. No, it wouldn't. This pitch is slow, yeah? This is also the time where I'm going to start looking quite terrible, so I'll keep my glasses on so no one can judge me. I've got a hair here somewhere. Someone on Twitter just asked me if I have seen the Hair of Fairy movies, and now I have that song in my head. You know, the one that goes... Fira, 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 hair of fairy. <laughs> it's 3 a.m. Uh, Sri Lanka's 55 for 3. It's time to eat samosas. I have green chutney. Imagine if I poured that on the floor, holy smokes. It gets to this point where I don't really know what I'm doing with my life, but hopefully just another hour and then we can go to sleep. You know what, for ages I couldn't get around green chutney and now I love it. Claudia Yadav's bowling well. Recognize this music? We're in the final over and I'm nervous. Sri Lanka needs five of five. I reckon that considering what Team India has no doubt been through in the past 48 hours, that they did well to take what was a very low scoring game right down to the wire. And that is saying something. It's 3.58 a.m. This is always a time where, like always after the match, I wake up. But I need to go to sleep. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Why don't you comment below if you think of things you want me to vlog while I'm in lockdown. Good night. Stay safe. I love yous. And I will see you very soon. Bye.